how's it going? It's Farmer Nick. Welcome back to Honeydew Farms, episode 9 or 10 on Honeydew, or on the tournament here. So what we're doing today, guys, is we are back here making some hay on the farm. Not too many people on here this morning, but, you know, it's alright. Uh, the money situation, I'm not sure what's going on. I gotta talk to everyone and see what the heck's up with that. Uh, we left with a little bit, and I don't know, I haven't been back after the live stream. I had to get off. So I don't know what has all happened about the money situation, but I am not uh, going to look into that because no one is really up yet. So we're just going to get uh, mowing some hay here, or grass. Ryler is in here also, but it's heading for me. And uh, Demon, you know, he just got up. He's starting to go uh, deliver his load. He'll probably be on later tonight, and we'll be all good. So, yeah, we're going to make a lot of hay here today. We've mowed, like, basically all over there where we all always have done and everything. Uh, we got to eat our Ryler like to put those weird goofy duels on it, so that's what we put on it. Not sure what tractor that we're going to put on the windrow yet, but I guess we will uh, do that when we get there. Um, yeah. Ryler, is there any up there that I missed? I don't know if he's talking or not. Oh yeah, there's a whole boatload up here. But is it actually Green Road or what? Yes. Yeah, so I can't mow that. It sucks. The time got sped up, mm -hmm. and uh, I can't go do. I can't do nothing about it. So. No, it's like fully grown, like grass. It's not like half grown. It's. Well, Come up here by me. I know where you're talking about. I can't mow that. We don't own that land. Oh really? So let's drop these mowers in here somewhere. We just kind of dumped all the bean equipment off here somewhere. Um, we're just gonna drop this uh, off right now. Back it up. Uh, let's drop it right there. Back up. All right, we're good. Now let's find the merger. Should be somewhere in here. All right, let's back it up. See if we can get her out better than better than what we uh, did. Uh, no, I guess we didn't. We ran into... I don't know what uh, Noah's doing in here. I guess Noah's in here all of a sudden. Don't know where he came from. Whatever. Um, yeah, so let's run over here. And see where Ryler has everything going. Well, looks like he started off over here. So, yeah, we've done lots of mowing hay, tedding, and all that stuff beforehand. So that's why I'm getting right into windrowing and stuff, because I didn't really want to do too much. We did a little bit in the last video, but I want to just do some windrowing today. So it's going to windrow that way. Okay. I've never used this merger much in 17, so it's going to be a first attempt at using it. We can go about 14 mile an hour, so that's awesome. Just got to stay behind Ryler, and we should be all good. We should be able to keep right up to him, because he's coming the other way, and... I'll be coming back the other way here very shortly. So hopefully we can have some nice, very nice straight windrows. And we'll uh, go from there. Oh yeah, Riley, you can only go one way with that thing. You'll see how it glitches. You can only ted one way. It's pretty uh, stupid. So you'll see it's going to be all spotty. You're going to have to come back and redo that all. I don't know. This map in here we've noticed has some big problems once in a while. Now, is there a way that I can... Change, lift, higher. I don't know if there is. I don't think there is. that do? I don't know what I did. Let's drop it down here and see what it does. Oh. That's how you do that. Okay. Now I know how to switch it from side to side. Cool. Now let's just back up here and uh, we'll get this going again. Uh, let me know if you guys want to stream in here again. Do you guys like how we're doing the streams every Friday night or every other weekend or whatever? Whenever we get time. Let me know if you guys are enjoying that so far. And we should be able to do it. Or keep it going as we're doing. Let me know. Uh, let's run up here. Uh, I 
guess we're just gonna forget about that bit. Cause that little bit hay isn't gonna really mean too much to us, or a lot. So we'll rather be coming back up here, we'll have to wait for him, and then hopefully he doesn't re-tether uh, Winrow there. Cause that won't be nice. We got the plows going also. So I guess we'll just wait up here for Ryler to come with that, what is that, a 48.50 or 49.50, one or the other? There, Ryler? 49.55. Awesome. Get out of the way, finally. Awesome. Yep, she's all good. I'm going to head back down here and come back up the other way since it's glitchy. I don't think this bailer is going to be able to bail all this, but we'll find out. Chill buff. It's going to be the exact same thing with the windrower, too. I guess we'll straighten this out, why not? Um, yeah. I guess we'll run up here, shut her off, drive all the way to the other end, and then turn around and come back up, because this thing wants to be really, really weird. Kinda sucks, but hey, it's whatever. Ryler and I both have to do it. It's nothing we can really do or fix. It's just kinda whatever. Let's run down here, turn her around. Ryler's going in the pond, and I think I'm probably gonna end up half to too. Hopefully not. Kind of put a headland on there. All right, let's back up, cut it over, and drop her down. In the pond, I guess. Um, yeah, so now, um, let me know, guys, how you're doing the tournament. Um, hopefully you guys are okay with me just doing the tournament here for the next month or two. And then we'll go back to a new map that's going to probably get released hopefully soon. Not going to say too much about it, but our random sparks, or random, I don't know how you guys, what's his name? Specifically, I can't remember, but it's like random sparks or something like that. That guy, uh, he's got the map and he's already got early access to it. So I'm going to see if I can get a hold of it and maybe do some videos on it. But, you know, I really like this map in here, how we're doing. So for the next month, we're probably just going to be doing this. And then it's going to turn into sap season, maple syrup and all that stuff. So there might be a few videos of that stuff, hauling sap, you know, messing around. And then it's probably going to be back to farm sim again. We'll have to see how everything goes. Back it up a little more. So if anybody knows why you have to do this, it's a little weird, and I kind of hate it how you have to go like this. I don't know why it, why this happens, but it's just so weird that it really drives me nuts. We'll put it that way. So Riley, he's probably going to do all those short rows, and then he'll get that done, and then he'll come up one full width, so. Probably what we'll do here is very shortly. Is there enough really there to win row? Not really. So I guess we're going to have to go to the road now. Is there anything I really need to change on my mic there, guys? Let me know in the comment section if there is, and I will try and mess with that stuff. I'm starting to get a little more familiar with this mic and everything else with it. We're just kind of scraping the leaves off the corn, which is all good. But all we got left is the corn right there. We'll have to get to that another day. Just turn a flash around. The cops will be coming around the corner here shortly. It's kind of weird. It sucks at the same time. go straight. We'll put a nice straight wind rail and then we'll come back and probably put more in this wind rail. It's not going to be a heck of a lot in it, but we'll fix it up. Just drive her down. Yeah, so. I guess we got a rotary beacon on. Might as well leave them on. This is pretty common for a lot of people when you get this stuff going. You do see a lot of uh, water kind of just drove in that a little weird 
I'll to drive to the other end. Get more. I'm, I wish, I'm hoping Giants will fix that problem, how we have to drive all the way to the other end and then come back up. But I think it's the new maps that have been made. I think it's only, I don't think I remember that happening in Ravenport. So, I don't know. If you guys know that that you're having that problem in Ravenport too, let me know in the comment section. But yeah, leave me some comments, questions, and I'll answer them. Try and get back to you guys. Stick this winner over here. It looks like someone sucked at mowing. She's all good. So we're just kind of clearing the edge of that. We're going to take a little bit off this wind row. And then we want to leave a little bit, but we want to make sure we're getting it all. And kind of straighten it out all one with here too. Or basically just take it all. Make a nice huge one right there. Pretty much how we're doing. Oh, Riley's got some more up here. Let's go up here, I guess. I don't know, Riley's busy getting stuff hooked up or uh, getting stuff done first thing this morning for uh, school and stuff. Getting all the school projects and stuff finished up so he can be on here all day playing with us and we'll be all good. Riley's not driving like a madman, that's a miracle. So we'll get to some bailing here very shortly. Uh, I know, do you guys like hate the haying videos or do you guys not really care for the haying videos? Because they seem to not do as good as a real life, like a harvesting and stuff in uh, Farm Sim here. What do you guys want to see? What is your favorite kind of video type thing to do in Farm Sim? Like harvesting, plowing, fertilizing, making money, like selling cattle and stuff like that. Like what is your favorite thing to kind of see on camera? Let me know if you guys know. Or maybe you guys don't have a real favorite. You just like watching them all. Just whatever comes you like to watch. Let us know. Give me that goofy thing there. But that's alright. That's kind of where the borderline ends. It's kind of weird how it's all set up. It's really really weird Let's turn this off and should be able to run back with the 7230 yep so we're gonna keep this nice 7230 uh, she's got 1.7 hours on it not bad really stop think about it but it could be better or it could be worse too That fuel tank actually gauge works there? That's pretty cool. I didn't know how it showed you half a tank, three quarter of a tank. It's kind of just ease in here. Hopefully we don't hit Ryler, we're all good. Main feature was not to hit Ryler coming back through here and we'll be all, so that wouldn't have been too good. Would have probably wrecked the end shield there and maybe got tore some, uh, chunk off the belt wouldn't have been too good scratch the paint I don't think I would have been happy alrighty so we'll probably get these bales all stacked up here later tonight and might be a video of us hauling them in here we'll see but we're just gonna keep doing the exact same thing we're gonna have lots of bailing to do. Um, we're gonna stack them how we did them in the back, but we got two little sheds back there that we're gonna put the hay in. So I'll kind of give you guys an update on that stuff in the next video on where all the hay went and everything. Oh, we're taking too much now. Windrows are not gonna be too perfect, but I know I'm gonna fail it, so I kind of know what's gonna go on here or what happened, how I windrowed it. That'd be the nice thing. Riley's going the other way, it looks like it. So we'll have to, we come back down, we'll have to switch the width thing to the other side, and then we won't have really any problems coming back down at all. So run down here and come back up. Oh, 
I don't think you see too many uh, mergers going. We mostly see uh, wheel rakes in our area. It's not common to see something this big, really. It's mostly small guys, and there's these big dairy guys that have these big double wheel rake thing type kind of things. But that's basically what's kind of common in our area. Run down there, switch that around. And Riley's just gonna go the other way. We'll go this way, turn around, bring that one up, and get the baler. We're not gonna do a lot of bailing just because I think I've done lots of bailing on here before in like episode like 21 or something not too long ago. We'll see. I wish there was like 72, 30 uh, Magnum, Case IH uh, Magnum out there that didn't have the front linkage on it. That would be a lot better. Just because I don't really like this European front linkage stuff on here. It's like, I'm an American guy, right? I live in American. So I don't do all this non UK, all this stuff, European stuff. Um, I wish there was an option for it. But obviously, Giants are getting better on it. What, I got a feeding in the middle now? There we go. Maybe we should just leave it like that. Have both wings feeding in and just have the inside up doing nothing. It's kind of a, not a bad idea. Maybe we're getting both angles and she's not kind of flicking around to the one. We can kind of get the winter of the same width all the way down, nice big ones. What the heck's got going on up here? I don't know, back 10 skills looks like it. Looks like grass actually gonna just, the grass is probably just gonna, I'm not gonna flick in there first, so. All right, so what we're gonna do up here is we're just gonna take the edge of this stuff, and if we miss a little bit around the corn, stick the planter over the plow, and it'll automatically disappear in the end. Ryler again. Yeah, if you guys are wondering what's going on here and there, uh, the time got sped up, I guess, and that's where everything kind of got happened here with the grass. So she's all good. Go all the way down here and get the baler up, bail this all up. It'd be easier for uh, Ryler there, and then It'll just work out a lot easier because you're going to have all this gone. And then... Alrighty, baler is right there. So we got the big wide extension thing on out. How we had on one of the live streams, we put the wide on. This is even though it's an 8370R. Never used this baler before, brand new. So we're hopefully this thing's going to work. It's runner. get this little bit here it looks like it and then we'll run down to the other end come back up up and down we shouldn't be have too many more problems because we should be able to kind of follow in row all the way down and then we shouldn't have too many problems i'm not sure if we're going to buy an actual stack wagon or we're going to buy just a loader tractor and then just go around and i'm not sure how we're going to do all that stuff yet but we'll have to probably do a video on that you guys see you guys can see what's going on but the reason if you guys are curious why we have such wide tires on it these windrows are wide and we want to have wide spacing so we're not tramping down the hay on each side of the windrow we want to be able to pick it all up you know but I don't want this actual wide really I guess there's not much else I can really do but I just wanted to make it a little different to put it that way so this is one of the windrows that we took place in and we didn't Got any bales out yet? I think that's our first bale. Looks like it. Uh, let's run over here and, you know. Drop her down. Go. 
Take a nice full windrow here. You can hear the tractor just roar. Look at that old tractor just puffing smoke out of her. Well, not smoke, but fumes. Probably gonna get a heck of a lot of bales, that's gonna be a good thing. Just for the simple reason is we're gonna need a lot of hay. I'm not sure how many cows we're gonna go, but we might possibly get sheep going here too. So we'll have to see. Probably end up placing like a sheep pen out here. Where I'm sitting, I'm thinking. But see how things go. Try not to miss any. See if I can do as good of a uh, bailing job as I did with Quinn Rowan. Maybe better. One back here, maybe. Turn around. Grab this one. Then we'll come back up that long one. And we'll turn around and grab that little half ass row back there. And they'll be able to get here. I wonder where Ryler is. He's pulling the other one. This is kind of nice. You can actually kind of put your hood on the actual row. It's kind of a nice and easy. Nice coon big baler here. Shouldn't have too many problems with it at all, hopefully. Um, there's not too many different balers at all. How 17, yeah, how 17 had the New Holland Square baler. I'm surprised that there's no New Holland Square baler in here. But I think they made it so you'd have to use the coon. I'm not sure. I'm not, no... I don't work for Giants, so I couldn't tell you what Giants were thinking there, but I think that this video, please smash that thumbs up button, subscribe, turn on post notifications, and I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you got any questions, uh, any suggestions what I should do for video-wise, or what you guys want to see, let me know by dropping it in the comment section, and I hope you enjoyed it, and thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next one. Thanks for watching, guys.